Um, welcome guys to Creative Methods. Um, I'm just going to make a quick video on uh, how to install the BTMM template. I know most of you always have uh, challenges in installing this BTMM template, so I'm just going to show you um, the easiest way of installing the BTMM template. So we have got um, MT4 and MT5. We have MT4 and MT5. So the way we install an MT4 is a bit different from the way we install an MT5. So that's one thing that people um, always um, make a mistake. All right. So on MT4, we do have an installer file. On MT4, we do have an installer file that we can actually use um, to install the template, All right? For those um, who are asking themselves, uh, where is the installer file? Where can we get the installer file for MT4? I'm just going to show you on my uh, YouTube, uh, on my Telegram channel. So I've got a Telegram channel, this one right here, which is called uh, Creative Effects Rombo. That's the one that you can actually go and check the files. There is also another one, um, which is called uh, Another one which is called uh, BTMM. There's another one called BTMM. I was trying to look for it right here. Another one called BTMM. Okay, this one right here, which is called BTMM Simplified. That's the one where you can actually uh, check the files. I sent the files a long time ago. So for those who keep on asking me where to get the files, you just have to click here and then go to the shared files, you can find them. Uh, the files, if you open the files here, you can see there is the, the VIX template and quarter theory. You also have the work time, this one that shows the agent boxes for MT5. You also have got this file, which is MT4, MT5, that shows you um, the, 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 the installers for MT4 and MT5. So I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna show you um, these files, they are there. On the, on the channels, please just go on the channels and check them for yourself. So I'm just going to show you the only way to install this file. So the way we install the MT4 is pretty simple. You just double click right here, it's gonna say run. You say run and it's so simple. It's as good as installing a software on your phone. It's as good as installing a software on your phone. Click agree, click next and you'll see, it's gonna say downloading files and it's gonna, um, uh, push this um, and give you the next uh, button after it has completed that. Um, then after that, it's going to show you, it's going to show you um, the, it's going to show you the MetaTrader platforms that are in your, uh, MetaTrader platforms that are in your, your MT, that are in your, sorry, that are in your, your, your computer, the metadata platform that are in your computer. Sorry, I just clicked the wrong file right there, but, um, sorry, I just clicked the wrong file there, but I'm going to show you, um, okay, just a minute. Okay, these are the indicators. So, okay, I'm just looking for my template that is actually an Excel file, the template that is actually an Excel file. That's the one that I'm looking for right here. That's the one that um, you can actually install so easy. Okay, fine. Okay, let me just click on this channel and check if I can see something here. Okay, right, 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 right. Okay, just a minute, just a minute. I'm looking for the file. Right, this is the file that I'm talking about. Uh, save as, and I'm just gonna save it on my, uh, right, on that folder again. I'm just gonna save it there. Right, let's wait for it to download. <coughs> right, this is the PTMM installer. It's just gonna download right now and then it's done downloading. Okay, we've completed, so we'll have to so the file appearing on your tools folder. This is the file. So you click it, you click run, and after clicking run, you click yes, 
And then this is for M24. It's gonna show you this BTM market maker uh, with Steve Mauro. Okay, it's showing me that the wizard detects a meta trader program that is running because I've got uh, a meta trader program that is running. So this one, uh, the meta trader, that's the reason why it's refusing to install. So it means that first of all, close all meta trader platforms. After closing all meta trader platforms, then you can uh, install this. It is the same way you install um, your 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 uh, your softwares. So it's one and the same thing. It's as easy as that. After installing it, then you can open your MetaTrader. You realize that after opening your MetaTrader, um, let's say you have a clean chart. Let's say this is a clean chart. So if you want to install, you just right click and come to your templates. Right there, you're gonna see. Your, um, your templates are going to be listed right here. And in this regard, um, we normally use, uh, we normally use, okay, just a minute. I'm just gonna show you something. Just gonna, we normally use this one, uh, 15 minutes FXCM with stop hand or 15 minutes FXDD with stop hand. However, the reason why we've got different types of templates uh, it's because people customize these templates the way they want them to be. As you can see, I've got mine right here, which is called Brombo One, Brombo One. So the reason why it's because I customized it the way I want it to be. That's the difference. But it's one of the same things. It's all about playing around with the colors. So I was just simply trying to show you the MT4 um, installer. All right. Now let's say you don't have the installer, or you are actually on your MT5. So I'm just going to show you here, it's one of the same thing um, with your MT4 and your MT5. So you just come here and click File. Let's say you don't have any, uh, let's say you don't have any indicators. So you are right here, you click your indicators. Okay, let me just use those ones. This is my MT4. I'm just going to click indicators from any file that you took from my channel. So you just press, you just press, Control, press Control plus A. Control A, all right? Control A will mark everything. And after that, you press Control C. Control plus C. Control plus C is for copying. So if you press Control plus C, it means you have copied everything. And then you close your page, right? You close your page. After closing your page, then you come to your MetaTrader and you click File. You click Open Data Folder. It's going to open the data folder where it stores most of your files. So right here, you've got MQLF4, you click there, MQLF4, you click indicators. Then what you do, you click once and then you press Control V. So in this case, it's going to copy all the indicators that you place right here. Like you can see right here, I already have the indicator, so I'm not, I'm not gonna copy, I'm just gonna cancel uh, the copy, all right? Uh, all right, so it's going to copy everything right there. So when you are done, you minimize your page, go to your MetaTrader, and you click on View, Navigate. Then you come on Indicators. On top of Indicators, you right-click. Then you say Refresh. It's going to refresh and put every indicator right there so that's exactly what you do when you say uh refresh is going to put every indicator that you've copied there so it means now you can actually start uh, building your your indicators you can start building your 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 own template however if someone also gave you a template you still copy them the same way maybe let's say he gave you a template and indicators like i always do so you first copy your indicators after you have done that. Then you go and copy the 
templates, you come here, file, may open data folder, and then you go to templates, and then you paste them in your templates. So if you paste in your templates folder, even if you paste, paste it uh, written Grombo, it's just gonna appear the same way uh, from your MetaTrader. The only thing that you have to do is to click refresh again. So each time when you go to your templates, you just go and search the template that you want to use, that you want to use. Whether it's your MT5 or it's your MT4, it's still one and the same thing. And then you just click Grombo, it's going to show uh, the template. It's going to show the template just like that. So that's all that you are actually um, supposed to do. That's all that you're supposed to do. So it means if you click Control and I, it's going to show you the list of indicators that are actually um, on that, that are actually on that uh, template. So it's gonna show you the indicators. If you want to remove one of the indicators, you just click there, then you click delete, it's gonna be removed. If you wanna add the indicators, then you will have to say view and go to navigate and then you pick the indicator and drop it in the chat. It's just, just gonna show you in the chat with all the details that you're supposed to place like this right here. So it's just gonna show you everything that you're supposed to fix and then you just say, okay, 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 okay. And you are done, that's it. So that's all about uh, installing this indicator. It's very, very simple. I always hear people asking, oh, how am I supposed to put the indicators in my MT4? I actually placed, um, actually gave you the instructions, but I saw that most of you guys are failing to get the instructions correct. So if you follow this method, it's so simple. It's the same way, copy your indicators, put them in at the rightful um, template. Make sure that you open the MT4 that you want to paste your indicators. But if it's your MT5, also make sure that you open the MT5 that you want to paste your indicators. If you have the installer for MT4, then you can just click the installer for MT4. So some people always ask me, why do you have the Asian session for, for um, the Asian session for, for MT, the Asian session for MT5? So I always tell them that the Asian session for MT5, it's there. Uh, the indicator is called work time. I'm not sure if I have it right here. My computer is called work time. All right, this one right here, it's called work time. So if you, you just copy it the same way you copy the indicators on your indicator list. So it's one and the same thing. That's just exactly how you're supposed to do it. So I hope this is helpful guys. And I hope um, it makes sense and it's going to help you uh, on installing your templates. Um, have a wonderful day. Cheers.